So wouldn't you say that the attempt to claw back or, or the right of freedom of speech isn't so far absolute as instrumental? And based on that, therefore, there are some cases where freedom of speech of some individuals can be curtailed if we want to get the better appreciation of the Logos and a better inclusion of more voices that are currently being shut out as a result of the extremity and radicalism of those select few. Wouldn't you say that's the case? Thank you. Well, well there's a very simple answer to that, which is yes, but I'll elaborate. I mean, the first thing is, like, I'm not an admirer of hate speech laws. But that doesn't mean that I'm naive enough to think that there's no such thing as hate speech. So obviously, if you've ever been involved in an extremely serious argument, you know perfectly well that there's such a thing as hate speech, because you've probably uttered some. So, you know, so, and, and, and there's, there's also no doubt that there are forms of speech that are utterly reprehensible, and some of those are actually already punished by law. 